<laughs> all right guys so today's video is about how to connect m active watch to iphone so i'm showing you how to do that if your watch is using m active app just like this so let's get down to business all right the first thing to do here is to go to your m active watch and switch on the bluetooth power and visibility so just swipe down the watch face and go to this icon here and switch on the bluetooth power and visibility make sure they are both on as you can see both settings are now switched on go back to the home page now go to your iphone and switch on the bluetooth the wi-fi or the data connection and the location or the gps so let's go ahead i'll be switching on my bluetooth as you can see bluetooth connection enabled switch on my wi-fi or my data connection and i'll be switching on my location so you have to go to the settings of your iphone then you go to your privacy select the privacy option then you are going to see location service you toggle it on as you can see mine is already on so once you toggle it on then you can now go out to the home page and you are ready to connect your m active watch to your iphone now the next thing to do is to go to your app store and download m active app you can also use the qr code here to scan it but i prefer you download it direct from app store so let's go to our app store and search for m active app m active app yeah this is the one that we are looking for there are a lot of m active app there m active app 2 m active app pro and m active so you are selecting just m active so you select that get option when you select that it's going to ask you to install so install and input your password so this works for any iphone that you are using any model so as you can see it has download so you select open when you open the m active app is going to ask you to use your location so select allow while using app m active would like to use bluetooth select ok so once you have done that then you come to this device page okay you select the device option here when you select the device option it's going to bring you to this page then you select add device when you select add device you are going to see some option pop up right you can see our watch 6 here and you can see iphone and you can see hw12 so let's select our watch 6 which is our m active watch 6 as you can see right now it says connected watch 6 bluetooth pair request you select pair okay once you do that you are going to see that your connection will change up here in the bluetooth icon of the smartwatch as you can see then you select what sees allow to display your notification allow so that i can get notifications so i'll be showing you how you can use it to get whatsapp notification and all stuff like that now it has been connected as you can see it is connected it's right connected on my smartwatch so you can use it to change your watch face now let's go and change the watch face of this smartwatch select the dial push option now you can see the dial are coming up so i'm going to change this dial to one of these dials that are here so let's change it to mickey mouse dial when you select the option anyone that interests you then you select start pushing okay and so let's start pushing is going to sync up to your smartwatch as you can see right here on the smartwatch it's already uploading it mtk to a smartwatch it's so fast and so easy all right now you can see our mickey mini is right on our m active watch so this is how to change the watch face of your m active watch using m active app so if you want any other one you can just scroll down you are going to see a lot of them there in the dial now if you want to customize it to your watch face like this just come to the dial section here as you can see it's up here then you select picture okay now m active will ask you to access your photo so you have to grant it the permission to access it now you select allow access to all photos 
then you select your image then you crop in if you want to crop in you can crop in and out as you wish then once you are okay and satisfied and select the option done as you can see divine is on the watch so once you are ready you select start pushing option here so you select that start pushing option it's going to start uploading into your smartwatch right on the smartwatch you can see the percentage bar of downloading has appeared so once it's come up this way it's going to upload it to your smartwatch watch face so you'll be having a new watch face on our m active watch now you can see that divine is right on our smartwatch so the next thing to do here is how to get whatsapp notification on m active watch so here is what you have to do let's open our m active app again so you select m active app now we want to check if we can receive whatsapp notification on this m active watch so let's test it out i'll be sending a message to this phone right now so let me go to my app so i'll be opening whatsapp and let's see if we are going to be getting message from our m active app hello subscribe now okay as you can see the message dropping hello subscribe now and let's see if you have our watch our message on our mrt watch no message yet all right so let me show you how you can get whatsapp notification on your mrt watch okay so prior to this time we have connected the first bluetooth and we have to connect the second bluetooth because this watch uses two bluetooth okay right now you can see we have our first bluetooth connected here and if you swipe up like this you are going to see that no notification here you don't have any notification because it is not synced up to the second bluetooth for whatsapp notification and other notification like sms so all you have to do is to go to the home page swipe this way and go to the menu and search for this wi-fi icon here okay if you don't have the wi-fi icon you can also go to this message icon so that i can get notification so just select that it's going to prompt you bluetooth is not connected do you want to connect so you have to select connect when you connect it's going to take you to this bluetooth page where you can see search device so you select search device and it's going to search for your iphone right here you can see it's still searching just go to your bluetooth of your iphone We go to the settings and we go to our bluetooth of our iphone you can see it's just connected with one another one is going to pop up under under device option as you can see it has popped up and it's showing iphone on the smartwatch okay so you are going to select this iphone as you can see bluetooth peer request well since we like to pair with your iphone with this code number you select peer it's showing peer in here and you have to select peer so when you select peer it's going to connect to the watch 6. now you have two bluetooth connection synced up to your smart watch to your m active smart watch now it has been connected you'll be receiving notification from your iphone to your watch now let's test it out let's see if it's going to work let's see if it's going to work now i'll send a message to this a whatsapp message I'm going to my WhatsApp. Now I'm going to select Hello. How are you? So once I send it, it's going to show right here on my iPhone. Let's go to my WhatsApp message. As you can see, the how are you have dropped now let's check the smartwatch okay it is not up yet okay it's connected okay it's connected 
let's go to our message and fire is still not coming in is messages is messages received in notifier okay now let's go to our watch let's go to our iphone and go to the settings once again to the bluetooth settings and select this and you are going to see sync contact just tap on that and go back on the first watch six and go to the second one share notification make sure you toggle on the share system notification also so once you have toggled it on then we should be able to receive messages on both bluetooth connection now let's try it again so now let's test if this is connected and is working so let's just check it out hello john and let's see if it's going to drop all right you can see the message drop on my whatsapp let's see if it drop on the iphone all right now you can see the message on my iphone saying hello john so that is just how to connect your m active watch to receive whatsapp notification if you are having issues like that so if you want to change the time format of your m active watch uh, this is how to do it just launch your m active and you launch your m active go to your my option here as you can see it brings up the default user and every other information then you select the personal information tab when you select that you are going to see personal information and right here you can see time system okay 24 hours so when you select that then you are going to get another pop-up message here or option then you scroll down to 12 hours so if you have 12 hours on this watch that means you'll be having 12 1 2 3 on your smart watch but if you are using 24 hours you'll be having the 12 13 14 15 kind of time okay so that is the time system that are available so you select the 12 hours and it's going to set up and it's going to show setup successful once it has shown you set up successful you can see time system 12 hour system then you are good to go so that is how to connect your mrt watch to iphone and how to change wallpaper and how to have whatsapp notification on your mrt watch all these i've just explained if you have any question or comment please drop it down there in the comment section and i'm going to reply you as soon as possible i remember about and i'll see you on the next one please stay safe bye for now peace